Howdy YouTube, Dude RV. Hey, thanks for stopping by. I'm out here wandering around in Central Texas today and I find myself at Union Grove Corps of Engineer Park on Stillhouse Hollow Lake. And yes, indeed, I do have the scooter back in action. Thanks to Rabbi Jesus. We're gonna get on the scooter. I got the camera, I got the scooter, I got you, so let's go. Little, little jiggling while I get the camera set, all right. We want it to be perfect. All right. Cue the music! I am so glad Little Red is back! Kinda feel like I might have a little more speed out of Little Red. Rabbi Jesus said that there were quite a few shorts draining the battery. And it was that away, it was, it was inside the white wrapped up wiring harness, meaning that it was that way when I got it. So we're gonna see if we get better range now that a professional has worked over that wiring harness. Young love. Such a sweet thing. Now there's an airport right there if you're into flying model airplanes. Met a couple of gentlemen there. If y'all are watching, I appreciate your service. Now when I came in earlier, I saw a flock of turkeys, but I haven't seen any since. That's where you get your, your pass to get in. So we're gonna run down here and look at the boat ramp and the fishing dock first. And then we'll swing over to the camping loop area. It is a very windy day. Looks like it's probably always windy here at this park. Right, we're gonna come back up that way. 
I want to give you all a, a good look at the boat ramp head on. Nice big parking area for the boat trailers. There's your boat ramp. Lake is looks like it's a little bit low, which I, I find it kind of strange. It must be by design, because this has been a very wet winter, and it looks like the water has been real, real high. I'm thinking that maybe they've let a lot of water out of Stillhouse Hollow Lake so that uh, when it rains this spring, it won't flood again. Now, there's your fishing dock. And it looks like it's sitting on bedrock right now. Crappie will be running soon if they're not already. We're in the middle of March 2020. so great to have Little Red back. I love the Challenger, but Little Red just, I just like the way this little scooter rides. through the dump station. Well, they give you a code when you check in. That way, only people with a camping permit can get in. All right, we're going to run down this loop first. Down here where the screen shelters are and the swimming area. Playground. When your kids are tired of playing in the water and they're driving you nuts, Take them over to the playground and have them burn off some energy. Howdy. They have three screen shelters available for rental. I'm sure that those are in high demand. Big Class A was in my sight when I got here. I had to wait for them to move before I could get in. Site number three is where I am. Almost all of the sites, if not all of the sites here in this in Union Grove are lakeside. And, and it is, it's accessible to get down to the water. Uh, for, it's a bit of a challenge, mind you, but I can do it.
several shower setups. I think they have three shower units. Down here on the left, you'll see all the driftwood. So I think the lake has been real high recently. All that wood right there. It's all tent camping. It'd be a great place for Leon. Swim area. Over here on the left, you see how high that that bank is, and there's driftwood up on top of the bank. So I think that we would be underwater. All right, we're gonna climb uphill against the wind. and peaceful we're right on the edge of the Texas hill country not too far from Fort Hood Temple and Belton through now. Well, probably closer to three quarters of the way through now. opposite direction on this loop so y'all can get a look at how the campsites are laid out. Well, the young couple we passed coming in, that's their butt. We're gonna go the wrong way one more time. There she 
is me sitting up on the hill with a commanding view. We're gonna go ahead and loop all the way around. That'd be a good spot right there. Number one. We'll take it to the house. Stillhouse Hollow Lake, Belton, Texas. Man, those are always so much fun, especially now that we got a little red back in the game. Man, oh man. <laughs> hey, if you enjoyed that run, give me a thumbs up. Flash me out across your social media. If this is your first visit to Dude RV, you might want to backtrack so you under, on some of the videos so you understand what, what all the references to Little Red back in the game was all about. Uh, I hit a hit a spot where I couldn't do this kind of video for a, for a while. But anyway, we're back at it. So remember to click on the subscribe button, and and you also want to remember to hit that bell as well. I post new videos every Sunday morning, 10 a.m. Central Time. You don't want to miss out. I'm on a mission to document every Texas state park in the system. But along the way, I'm going to cool places like this. I mean, check that out. Lakeside camping. All right, with that being said, y'all come back now, you hear?